Okay, hello and welcome back to Shape of the World, where, um, let's see what chapters we got, right? So, we, we got quite far into it. <coughs> there are a few different things, right, so in the pyramids. Let's hopefully click resume and um, not hopefully glitch through the world. Um, the Shape of the World is very different today. These are the official channels that you'll be sure to go on if you want to see my actual stuff where it's not stolen. <laughs> If you are watching this elsewhere, then um, make sure you are on the official channels. Anyway, let's try not to glitch out into the minor realm again and get achievements for flying, because we were flying out of the world. That shape keeps moving. It's very disorientating. Okay, where are we? Right, so, I mean, sneaky peeky like. Okay, you're sealing me in. You're really going to seal me in. You're denying me getting back out. I will fight your denial. Also, you know, have I got seeds? You've took away all my seeds as well. We can't go backwards. You've denied me going backwards. There are some monuments that I didn't touch because, you know, there's an achievement for touching them all, unless it just didn't trigger. Right, this time, do not fling me into the miner's arm. Let's very carefully step onto this bridge. <laughs> if we fall in the water there, we get flung into the minus realm and out of the game. And, you know, so out of the game that we're in a different colour zone to the game even wanted us to be. But there were achievements for flying way more than we flew. And we got it because we flew out into the minus realm. I don't know if... I think it was the maximum f flying. There are secrets and things that are hidden and hidden paths. So... There are things that I've missed, because, you know, I had a sneaky look at the achievements after we crashed. So, you know, I think I've missed some things. So there are things for you to find and explore, as well as it being... Right, we've got no seeds. Give me some seeds. I need some seeds. Right, Totoro. <laughs> They're like Totoro creatures. My neighbour's Totoro. But yeah, I mean, it's supposed to be different for everyone, but I guess it also, you know, depends on how you play it. But if there are paths, it also sounds like it's, like, got specific paths that you can take. So it might not be as procedural and random as you might expect. Sounds like there might be paths, and I have taken a fairly direct path, I will say. Whether I'm going the fastest path, there's... More for you to explore. I don't want to spoil everything. So, you know, that's kind of why I'm going direct as well. It's like, give you plenty to find and explore yourselves should you choose to play it. And there is stuff to find and explore. And, you know, maybe there are interactions with the whale and things that you can do that I didn't read in the asset pack. Sorry, you were a little creepy to live. I wonder if you can, like, completely extinct a creature as well. That'd be interesting. It does feel like we're going back over the waterfall area that we were before. And I guess that's also why there's um the hidden walls as well. So to block you skipping areas, because maybe you could skip evolutions by doing that. <laughs> you know, if you walk to the pyramid pass in the wrong way, you're going to clearly skip evolutions. What are you, like, nose whales, slime? Some sort of weird blob. The crystal lizards. I want my acorns back. I'm trying to throw acorns at them and I have none. Maybe I need to find some in every world as well. Like there are a lot of... Do not take me out of the game. I don't know if that was um, showing on, on your end. Or just for me for recording. Right. There are these monuments again. I kind of wanted to have permaflight. So I think, I'm assuming you can sort of permaflight. Do not distract me. I saw that one over there. I'm not going directly to the evolution. Could I pull you again? Hello, hidden crystal ding-dongs. Maybe I've gone backwards to where I'm supposed to be by going down here. What is this blue floating thing? 
a slime smelt. Okay, so this is just back down here, but again, you know, I want the achievements as well in a way. There aren't at the moment Steam trading cards, but this is the sort of game that I would expect to have some because, you know, all the pretty little creatures people will want. Not only the cards, but the um, equivalent emote icons as well. Right, let's ring all the ding dongs. I see one over there hidden. I've got Nick here. In fact, there's quite a few hidden over here that I missed. Ding dong, ding dong, dong dong, ding dong. <laughs> Any more? I didn't get an achievement. I feel like there should be more. Is that all of them? I mean, the the one down there seemed like the obvious path, so I'm gonna go over here. It's like I don't want to go the obvious evolutionary path. I'm not the obvious evolutionary path, so you know. I'm not normal. So I will not be going the normal way. <laughs> Do we want to jump? I mean, you know, me I wanna jump. Even though there's a path around, and the path around might have more interesting stuff, but you know, let's just jump along. Just jump! And then change the world. Get my way, fish. Right. We're in dark colours again, though. Out you come. Right. <coughs> Hello! I have nothing to feed you. I'll take a closer look at you this time. Are you hostile, little sea creature? Pop. <laughs> I had to pop it out of existence again, you know, it's like... It's too sentient for this world. No. <laughs> I don't know why I popped it. So I'm determined to call the evolutionary thing a bat, even though it's like the most evolved creature here. It did not survive, right? So we have changed the evolutionary path of the world. And again, I guess that's like the slow playthrough if you get all of the evolutionary paths rather than the direct evolutionary paths. Because there is an achievement for doing the slow playthrough. Sorry, I'm culling your creatures from existence. Okay. You're immune to culling now. <laughs> oh. Or I pop you in the eyes. If I pop you in the eyes, <laughs> that's, that's their weak spot. Pop them in the eyes. Hmm. That doesn't lead where I thought it would. So some creatures require a seed to be popped. That one, you just pop it in the eyes. Hello. Slob lord. I'll just ride on your back. Hello. Yes, are these some... No... It flew me off, but it's a, it was a type of seed. So I can plant things again. <laughs> again, I may not have that many of them, but I can still plant something, and that's something. There are like 28 different types of seeds and trees, so there's quite a bit. I think it said 28. Oh, we fell off. Let's go over here. What's over here? Again, you know, there are hidden paths and maybe there is a lot of stuff if you go backwards. Because you can, well, to a degree. It, it did block off the world, as you saw, at that one point. So maybe it just blocked off all the previous worlds so you can't go backwards too much. But to a degree, we can traverse back. Right, let me up. Are you going to let me up this? <laughs> or is it going to cut me? Hey, don't punch me in the face. I can... Damn it, it's too slippery. Don't, don't try it, it's going to fling me out of the world. I felt that. It almost flung me through that. And I played Warden Melly of the Undergrowth. I've, I know a momentum fling when I see it. It's like, stop that. Get off that. You're not allowed to do that. <laughs> and I abused that to my own ends in that game. Which maybe I shouldn't have, but you know, I was having fun with it. Like crystal lizards or trees. New seeds new civilizations to boldly grow what no one has grown before yeah but 
We're now making Star Wars references. <laughs> oh, you guys have um, evolved bones, but you don't look that healthy for it. Eat a tree. That's just hide you in the trees. <laughs> Creator! So we must have planted a lot of trees. Hello. I guess that's the one that we're missing, although there's no achievement for it. Any more that we've missed? There's got to be more of those that we've missed. If I cling that one, I, th I feel like I have, but also... It looks like I have. <laughs> I couldn't reach it from this distance, which is why it didn't go off. But I'm not walking and risking falling off for it. Okay, now you've grown a lot more. Uh, why won't you let me cling them whilst I'm flying? I want to ping them all. Right, I will ping them all. I will go around pinging them rather than go directly to the exit. There's now a million of them. <laughs> now it's even harder to know which ones we have and haven't done. Also, have I done these crystals? Hey. Stop that. <laughs> At least we can pull ourselves out like that. Right, I'm going to ping these crystals. These ones we have to be closer to. So like we can't just do them through the wall like that other one. I feel like we've done these already in the last one. But, you know, maybe they'll grow extra. Right, ping me up, Scott, here. Any more? There's one over there, right? Damn it. <laughs> the gaps that we're falling through. I see them. There's a couple that we clearly missed. Seeds? Duncan? What? Right, grow some seeds. Any more. I still haven't got an achievement for that. No. Well, we're here. Let's plant everything <laughs> okay that made me have a gardener achievement <laughs> I will just plant more well because achievements also they help me navigate faster <laughs> yes I mean that gave me a Rainforest Explorer achievement for some reason. I don't know why. It's, maybe I created a rainforest and it's like, you're in a rainforest. You clearly explored the rainforest because you put so many trees. Your PC ran into a problem and needs to restart. You didn't see that on your screen. I did. <laughs> what? Um, okay. Hopefully... Nothing serious. Thanks for watching. Join us again for some more. Goodbye.